Hi everyone, welcome to another latest SpaceX updates video. Welding work still continues on the orbital launch mount. It does give us the impression that SpaceX is preparing the OLM for the worst case scenario if an RUD were ever to happen during the orbital test flight or future missions. But we saw some good signs that the welding work is coming toward the final phase. If we compare these two shots, one from a few days ago and the current one, we can clearly see a large chunk of the scaffolding has been removed already. So, crews are likely to finish their work on the OLM so that Booster 7 can claim its stage once again and we have evidence of that happening soon. Yesterday, two SPMTs with counterweights and a booster connector moved to the launch site potentially for Booster 7 to move under the chopstick arms. If Elon was right about launching the first orbital flight in the third week of April, we will probably see some positive signs for it in the coming days. Back at the Rocket Garden, a lot of things are going on. Crews were seen doing checks on Starship S24. And our speculation turns out to be true for Starship S26. S26 received its first Raptor engine after it was placed onto a new higher ship stand. This Starship, without any tiles or flaps, is the first Starship to get its engine while being in the Rocket Garden. Clearly, both the High Bay and Mega Bay are out of space and SpaceX didn't want to waste time. So engineers started installing the engine out in the open space. This is where this company stands out from the rest. I mean, who assembles rocket parts right next to an open public road? SpaceX is technically a private company but still, they are being transparent to the public. This is one of the reasons why everyone loves SpaceX. To keep up with its impressive launch cadence so far in 2023, SpaceX is targeting tomorrow to launch its 21st mission of the year. Starlink Group 510 mission is scheduled to launch on Wednesday evening from SLC-40 at Cape. Well, not much is happening elsewhere, so I will wrap up this quick update video here. Thank you for watching.